like fighting the auntie, you know, like don't take my money. It's a new year, can you believe it? Oh my god. Okay, so 2013 just flew by extremely fast and honestly, I did not really achieve anything. Okay, maybe I did. The only thing I achieved in 2013 was being on a poster in all the train stations. That isn't very fantastic, you know. So I hope that 2014 will be a better year. It's not I hope, I know that 2014 will be a better year for me and for all of you guys. And Let's just get into my haul because I just went shopping recently and I'm so sorry because I'm having a very 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 bad sore throat. I've been sick on and off for the past two weeks so I didn't really film any video because all I want to do is just lie on my bed and just sleep. So let's just get on. I recently went to City Plaza which is over at Paya Liba. Um, I like shopping there, it's one of my favorite place to shop actually. So um, I actually managed to snack around like I think 10 or 9, 9 or 10 items under $70. Honestly that is pretty expensive to me because my budget is usually $5 or $8 but I just thought that you know it's times have changed. It's difficult to find like $5 item unless you're going for a flea market. I just decided to just raise my budget man. So anyway the first shop that I entered I purchased um, this top. It was one for 10 and two for 15. So I got this um, peplum top. Uh -huh. and, and the back has this zip. It has this zip detail. So um, I really like this because I know the peplum craze has really ended, but I'm just getting into it, you know, it's so weird. But um, the thing I like about this is that it's very fitted, it's not like it's very loose at the waist, you know, that isn't flattering to your outfit at all. But this is actually really flattering because it is pretty tight fitting. So I wore it for my New Year's countdown by the way. Then after that, I got this um, mermaid skirt. This mermaid denim skirt. Um, I was contemplating on whether I should get it because it was really too girly, you know. But I was thinking like, why not? Because one is for 10 and two is for 15. I might as well just get two items. So I got this two. And then I went to this shop. And I got, this shop was one for eight, I think, and two for 10. I know like two for 10. So I got this mint um, embroidered tribal top. I saw this in Bangkok actually, I wanted to buy it in Bangkok the last time I was there but it was going for $12 in Bangkok so the fact that I got it for $5 now, it's a steal baby! Look at the details, so nice, okay? Then after that I got this short, um, which is this red denim tribal detailed shorts also. Uh, this is also part of the two for $10 deal. So worth it it's a really good fit moving on i got i got this top this is just a very plain jersey top it's a v pinstripe jersey top just a really simple top for me to wear to school i bought with all of my girl with all of us got the same top and then after that i got this uh, it's like a mandarin collar embroidered um, button down top. Um, I knew my mom was gonna love it the moment I saw it so I just decided to get it because I know my mom because I know that my mom would approve of it and surprisingly she asked me to give it to her so now it's actually hers. I decided to just give it to her. I mean I was, I was still still it because I mean I bought it but you know if she likes it I'll just give it to her. Like, no point. No point also what I mean I can always buy all kinds of clothes, but my mom is really picky, so if she like it, I'll just, I'm just gonna give it to you. Okay, then together in the same shop, I bought this sweater also. Um, it's just this Raglan looking sweater with this cutout detail over here. Can you see? So um, honestly, I'm not really a sweater person because I sweat really easily, but I just thought like, why not? Because uh, one, one is for 15, 
two is for 22 I think if I'm not wrong that's why I got two of it yeah but anyway I was thinking school is starting so I can just wear it to lecture then lastly I got this off this is just a normal um, ivory sort of ivory um, cut in top I'm sorry it's so crumpled because I never ironed it the back has this peekaboo detail and the back has this pleated detail so nice right it's like the front it looks so plain but the back it has like a pleated detail so um, I like how it gives extra oomph to my outfit but my mom says I look like I'm pregnant so I don't care at least I can keep it for my pregnancy next time so in the same shop I got this for $10 quite expensive honestly it is when I was giving the $10 I was like <laughs> Like fighting the auntie, you know, like don't take my money. But okay, I just gotta give it to her lah, cause I like it. <laughs> I don't know if I'll even wear more than ten times. So in the same shop, which is also the best buy of my day, will be this top. Oh my god, can you see it? And it will be this top. It is the current trendy Zara inspired top. Um, it, it is white in color. Okay, I got it for only eight dollars. Because I know a lot of you guys got it for 20 plus dollars online. But it's worth it really because the material is very good. The reason why I got it for 8 dollars is because there's a defect at the back. I don't know if you guys can see but there's like this coffee stain over there. And the auntie decided to let it go for cheap because she don't know if she can wash it. you know. But I was just thinking, ah, it's just 8 bucks and I have long hair. I can just cover the stain if I cannot wash it, you know. So 8 dollars for this. It is totally worth it. I was just thinking of buying it online. But... I guess I did the right choice to go to City Plaza before I buy it. So this was my best buy. After that I went to town with my two big brothers, the KL Twin Tower. And we actually got a matching uh, pants from h and It's just this uh, jersey pants. And it was only $7 from the $9.90 to $7. And we were saying that we were we were saying that we were gonna all wear it out together to have ice cream. So we'll see what it was. Hold that for me to be. Okay, then after that I got this four necklace from Forever 21. So it's for only one dollar! Yes, be quiet here. One dollar. My brother cannot even buy you a sugar cane. So um, I got this uh, cross necklace, can you tell? But uh, it's just this beaded rosary looking cross necklace for one dollar. Look at the bag. And also I got this um, pearl. Pearl um, wooden cross thingy for one dollar or so. Totally worth it. And next, it will, this is just a plain, plain um, golden cross. That's all. I was thinking of layering it with the other necklaces that I have. And they were all for one dollar, the tree necklace. And I got this um, arrow necklace. Can I see? This arrow necklace. So I got this for on I got this for $3. This is quite expensive, you know. But I was thinking four necklaces for six dollars in total. One necklace around one dollar plus. So it's pretty worth it. And that's all for my haul. Okay, that was like a really oop, 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 very quick kind of haul because I just didn't want to bore you guys out. But anyway, um Thanks for your support in 2013. I know I haven't really been really active on YouTube the past few months, like the beginning of the year. And I know there are a lot of things crop up and a lot of you guys are asking where is Cass. Cass is just really busy with her work so she's not doing this YouTube thing anymore. But don't worry, me and her are still friends. We are still talking almost every day so there's no problem with us. I'm just doing this channel alone and I hope that you guys will still support me even though I'm doing it alone, you know, because a lot of your support means a lot to me. And um, I told myself that I'll try to upload at least two videos every month in 2014, and I hope that I can do it because you know, when school starts, it's gonna be very, very busy for me. But I just really hope that I can do it. Lah. So um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this haul and thumbs up to this video. Comment down below. Let me know how did you guys spend your Christmas or your New Year's Eve. And you can always follow me on my Instagram over here um, for more updates about my daily life. 
Okay, subscribe to the Fatful family if you guys haven't and help us reach 2000 by the end of the month. And that's about it. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! Oh, <laughs>